Oh yeah, round two, boys. Look what we got today. Yeah, you know it, you know it. White and blue is here, <laughs> this is mine. So anyways, this is gonna be the first white and blue. I don't know if it's the first white and blue in the country. It's the first white and blue in here. That's right, yeah, that's right, boys. This is gonna be mine, my personal bike. What do you think I should do with this thing? I really am unsure. Start with us, I'm gonna stretch it, lower it, make it long, strong. You know, just like we did with the GSX-R1000. But then part of me is like, I want to keep it stock wheelbase, take this thing on the street, hang out with you guys, have some fun, see what it's all about. 2022 Hayabusa. Drop her down, C2. We got to take a look. Let's rip this thing open, see what we got. Box ain't even started moving yet. Woo-wee. She pretty in there. We're going to unbox it and see what it's all about. And we're gonna take this thing apart and start messing with it. Brand spanking new, break it in. I'm gonna show you the break in process too, guys. Let's get busy. guys you see it we got it pulled inside already it is approximately 1 40 p.m tuesday january no june 22nd we got to get this thing hooked up we rode one stock this past week we got to see what they were all about if you haven't seen that video drop a link right there you can go check that out where we took a black and copper one took it for a test drive took it to the racetrack we did a little bit of everything with it but me it's time to start modifying this thing see what they're all about you can see magic mike is over here working on a black and copper now we are doing a which one did this one get i think a pentacarbon full exhaust system on this bike it's gonna look super super good and me i cannot wait to dig in deep on these things take them all apart and see what they're all about the bikes that we got they were pre-sold we just put exhaust systems on them and that was about it we took a quick peek around cook a, took a quick look for our youtube videos so we can learn a little bit but now it's time to really do some work on these things and see what kind of power we can get out of them let's see what we got here yeah that's right boys brock davison at brock's performance has hooked us up before i got the bike i had my exhaust system sitting here waiting for me this is a full titanium system that I chose. So this is the lightest exhaust pipe on the market. We're gonna see what this thing's all about. I'm gonna get it unboxed here in just a second and show it to you. C2's almost got this thing prepped up, ready to go. We're about to get the windshield on it and then it should be about ready. I don't even think I'm gonna fire it up before I put the exhaust system on. There's no reason, I don't need to hear it stop. We gotta get this thing tore down. All right guys, so we got the bike all stripped down, got it on the lift and guess what? exhaust system is going on this exhaust system is super duper pretty full titanium look at the welds and stuff on this thing quality second to none super good looking exhaust crazy lightweight we're gonna have this thing on and fired up here in a minute we are also installing a set of brock's window links so we can lower the rear end you see i've already got the nuts off here we're going to be doing that and then we're going to be installing a brock's performance front end retention tie down strap what that does is that bolts on to the factory brake calipers runs over the frame rails here and compresses the front forks down a little bit now this is fully 100 percent reversible and optional how much you lower the front end me personally just riding around on the street we're actually gonna take it on the street again tonight cruise it around some we're going to bike nine at quaker stake and we're going to i mean you just snug them down lower the inch or two real quick and easy and then if you wanted to hit the twisties or something like that take it to the mountains or just want your full suspension travel for a smoother ride literally just push the button re release the front end pressure and boom you're right back to stock ride height we'll see what this thing looks like here in just a second lower as well as how it sounds with the new exhaust system and just like that we got it all back together with a full titanium brox exhaust system this thing looks and sounds super good super clean and we also lowered the front end a little bit we've got it snugged up we've only got it compressed about an inch down in the front right now that made it look way better we lowered the back end i did not want to delete the rear fender um me personally stock wheelbase i like the rear fender look 
Uh, but I did delete this right here. Um, this normally bolts on here. And then of course you got the reflectors on the side. This was super easy. Just unbolt that, throw that in the trash. And then I deleted the front reflectors too. They were right here. I don't know what we did with them. Probably threw them in the trash can. But anyways, they had a big reflector right here. That's just super simple to unbolt as well. Clean the look of the whole bike up. Super good. Let's fire this thing up, see what it sounds like. We have already let it warm up a little bit, so it is not quite a cold start. But you can tell this thing is definitely got some bass, got some rumble to it. so clean the brock's titanium exhaust really accents this bike nice i love the uh i guess you would say the matte look with the white it looks so fresh and so clean let's fire it up and see what it sounds like this is what everybody's waiting on if you have a gen 3 busa and you're looking for exhaust hopefully this will help you make your decision everybody wants to hear what these things sound like take it out on the street and ride this thing it does feel super super nice it is not too loud riding on the street is actually really mellow and pretty quiet to be honest with you uh, with the helmet on like I said I uh, didn't have I feel like I could ride it for hours and hours and not have any issues all right guys that's gonna do it for today's video I hope you enjoyed it smash that like button subscribe to the channel in the meantime check us out moremafia.com if you want to get your ecu flash if you need some merch look at that red white and blue america check us out we got it all on the website thanks for watching guys see you next time